Tale of Family and Scale back from the office and we're going to talk about kindness. This is part two. Um, every day we all get up and I know in our house, Doug gets up, grabs a shirt, grabs a pair of shorts, out the door he goes and that's how he dresses. I get up, there's a whole lot more decision making there which I think is with a lot of us. But every day when we get up, we think about what we're going to clothe ourselves with. So today we'll talk a little bit about carefully choosing our clothing and we choose our material clothing to protect us from the elements, from the weather, to make sure we don't get sunburnt or make sure we don't get too cold. But the Bible also tells us what we should clothe ourselves with, and that's with kindness, gentleness, and patience. It says we should put on a forgiving attitude and top it all off with love. So in these past few weeks, we need to be topping a lot of things off with love. And the great thing about this outfit it's one size fits all. It fits us all. All you have to do is wear it and to take that cloak on. So next time when you're trying to decide what to wear, put on a little kindness, gentleness, and patience and add some forgiveness and top it off with love. So the verse I'm going to leave with you today is from Colossians 3 verses 12 through 14. Therefore, as God's chosen people, God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, Clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Bear with each other, each other and forgive whatever grievances you may have against one another. Forgive as the Lord forgave you, and over all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. So kind of remember that the next time you get dressed, are you clothing yourself with love? And another verse I want to leave with you, Kind of along those same lines as Romans 12, 10. Love one another with brotherly affection. Outdo one another in showing honor. So not only should we be clothed in love and humility and kindness and gentleness, we almost need to be in competition with each other and seeing how much we can be kind. So we should strive to be kind to each other like it's a competition. We all want to win first place, but there are no places to be won there. We all are equal in that, and let's all be kind. Have a great day. God loves you, and be kind.